Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh Dear brothers and sisters Alhamdulillah rabbil alamin Hamdan kathiran tayyiban barqan fihi Wassalatu wassalamu ala rasulillah wa ala alihi wa sahbihi ajma'in All praise to, to Allah rabbil alamin Who have blessed us with so many blessings And one of the most blessed man is going to come very soon And this is known as Ramadan al-Mubarak, the fasting man. Ar-Ramadan ila Ramadan, muqaffarat baynahum. Whatever sin that we have committed last Ramadan, and if we are given the opportunity to fast again this coming Ramadan, Allah Akbar. Meaning Allah is prepared to forgive the whole years of sins that we have committed. Whether we do it intentionally or unintentionally, Allah knows best. But Allah, the All-Merciful, the All-Forgiving, is ready to forgive us again. And the door of forgiveness is wide open. So brothers and sisters, we hope that we will never miss this great opportunity for this coming year. And make sure that we are ready for this Ramadan. Not only physically we are ready, but we are ready mentally and spiritually. That we are going to do for the sake of Allah and we are going to give Him the best of this Ramadan. Because Ramadan is not just abstaining from food and drink, no. But it is a training man to control our nafs from the destructive desire, nafsul ammara bisu, to nafsul lawama. And insha'Allah, with the will of Allah, we will end with nafsul mutma'inna. Mean, now we are going to overcome all the bad desire. And we are going to replace it with something that is good. All the negative will be replaced by a thing that is positive. All the destructive will be replaced by all the constructive ones. By having this intention, brother and sister, then I'm sure, inshallah, your fasting of this coming year will be the best. It will be something very special for you. And you will see the changes in you. You will transform yourself again. It's like, you know, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala is opening his door to make us a new we, not the old we anymore. So let us grab the opportunity with the right intention, the right spirit, and the right value to prepare ourselves physically, or you say bodily, and also mentally and spiritually for the sake of Allah. And we believe, brother and sister, we can do it. You can do it if our Prophet the companions of the prophets, the first generation, the second generation, the third generation, have been given by Allah all the glory. The glory of Islam will come back to you and me. One, you are prepared to celebrate Ramadan al-Mubarak with the right spirit. Let us prepare ourselves for the sake of Allah and let us grab this opportunity, brothers and sisters, to make sure we are giving the best of ourselves for this coming Ramadan al-Mubarak. And may Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala make us a mutaqin, a person who love what Allah loves, hate for the sake of Allah, give for the sake of Allah, and withhold for the sake of Allah. Amin. Wa bilai tawfiqi wa laqri da'wana an alhamdulillah bil alamin. سبحانك اللهم وبحمدك أشهد أن لا إله إلا أنت أستغفرك وأتوب إليك السلام عليكم ورحمة الله وبركاته